Here is an observation. Not a single village can take on all the others. All the hidden villages are relatively equal in power, with leaf and sand being a little stronger. Actually, there is an unwritten agreement among them, which dictates that one village cannot have relatively more power than others. And that is why Chunin exams are conducted collectively. This idea of relative power was proposed by Hashirama. Hashirama was fed up with never-ending conflict, and just like Madara, wanted to make a world of only victors. Before villages, this used to be a battle of clans. So, Hashirama proposed the village system to merge different clans in a single place. This system worked in the Land of Fire. Different clans in other lands also followed this example, and thus five great nations emerged. Just to maintain the balance of power, Hashirama collected all the beasts and divided them among nations. But what if one of the villages tries to amass more power than others? Before the Third Great Ninja War, each village used to take their Chunin exams individually. But after the war, they started to conduct the exams twice a year and collectively to improve relationships and to keep a check on how many shinobis each village was producing. 